The buttons what press. Up, nerds? So again, this is uh, Peter and Tim here, opening up cards I don't know anything uh, about. So we found out last night you do need to check the number of packs that you get in these. Oh, okay. I have Jovan opened seven packs in his kit. What? Yo, I guess he just. Okay. I made him not open one of the packs. Got it. <laughs> it's fair. All right. Well, I have my six packs. That's so. Good. I I think I also have six. Yeah. Yeah. Mine was well organized. My first five, six were one of each color. So mm. last night I opened a red one. I think I'm just going to start organizing right away. That's the way to do it. I'm sure somebody on camera is going to flame me for the way I'm I mean, deciding to do this. Someone's going to flame you regardless, I feel like. True. That's why you have to preemptively flame them back. True. <gasps> Yo, okay. Yo, oh, that's the uh, weak stone. Yeah, the might stone and the weak stone. Well, I don't know if that actually showing on camera. I don't know. I might gotta show you up. I got an ornithopter. <laughs> <laughs> that's a great. Oh, yeah, ornithopters. <laughs> ornithopter gaming. I totally played it. Wait, I have a. Yeah, one up to you. I got the reconstructed doctor. I mean, you gotta go with the classics. A zero two will beat that out every time. <laughs> yeah. Yo, but this one can come back from the grave for one turn. <laughs> Alright, so I'm just gonna put my rares in a pile. Cause... I mean, that's should be building the deck around the strongest cards. I don't know, sometimes the rares can be trash. <laughs> that's true, but I don't think uh, the might stone weeks to with that trash, is it? it that's, I think it's... Isn't no, it like this a, is really good. It's like a draw and a mana. Yeah, you just gotta get the Urza now. I just need Urza. Though so I think there's like three different Urzas in this. Brotherhoods and is actually a good card. So that's this card. I'm probably holding it up to the camera wrong, but that's fine. Fancy foil great worm. Ooh, Foundry Inspector. Artifact spells you cast cost one less to cast. So that seems really relevant here. Why do you think they don't call this landfall? <laughs> Who knows? I guess I should do that. All right. Actually, uh, I might be playing Brothers End, so I'm gonna put that in my good rare pile. I've noticed with this set, because it's a lot slower, that ramping is really good. Energy Refractor, that's a decent card. <laughs> it's like, decent man. Oh my gosh, wow. Phyrexian Dragon Engine. Oh, that's a fun this is one. another really good card. If you can unearth it. Wow, I have playable rares today. That's new. Oh, hey, this would be good with like a white deck. The beginning of your end step if you control two or more creatures. Oh. Wow, okay, that's really good. Yeah, it's a five mana four six, too. That's crazy, actually. Well, maybe not crazy, but... Ooh, Thrawn Vigil. That's really good for, like, reanimation. Whenever one or more artifacts in slash four creature cards leave your graveyard during your turn, play 1-1 one, one counter on target creature you control. Nice, nice. That might be decent. And then it kind of continues over under this one. There's a Power Stone yeah, Prodigy. Draw a card, then discard a card. Yeah, you discard one or more artifact yeah. cards. Create a tap Power Stone token. Huh. That could be like really good in maybe a Demir deck. I always thought this enchantment was funny. Painful quandary. Oh yeah, I got absolutely destroyed by Jimmy with that. Yeah, like, that's a crazy, like, downside. Especially if they don't have, like, enchantment removal. Is that anybody, or is that... An opponent. Yep. I was about to say, like... So, like, you yeah, have to ridiculous. discard a card whenever you want to cast a spell. Yeah. Ooh, I got the Gabo. 
I don't know. I kind of want to try the Gabo in the Gabo deck. This card seems dumb, but, like, but I'm pretty sure it's trash. At least in... Yo, okay, we're melding. We're melding, gamers. Wait. We have the Phyrexian oh. Dragon Engine and Mishra Tamer. Wait, no, wait that, that, no this that's is the wrong, wrong Mishra. Claimed by Gix as the Mishra. Oh man. I got really excited. <laughs> <laughs> I thought we were going to be meld gamers today. Alright, we opened up our first Power Stone token. Hype. Oh, Black Blade Reforged. Oh, that's a fun card. Yeah, this is a really good card. I think this... If I can put this on a big creature, that's really good. Yeah, yeah, I remember... Is that the I card I played in Commander. Commander? Yeah, this is a pretty popular Commander card. So. This card, Spectrum Sentinel protection yeah. multicolored is really bad in this set. <laughs> it does not do anything. Ooh, Kayla's Command. Create 2-2 two, two colorless construct artifact. Play 1-1 one, one counter creature you control against double strike till on your train. This seems okay. But I don't really have white cards for that. <laughs> I think this was in that Necron deck. Mystic Forge. Oh yeah, there's no way that isn't. That card's ridiculous for that. Well, I have an idea of what I want to do oh, look now. That. That's you know, I actually... Look how many red cards I opened this time instead of, like, four from nice. yesterday. It's because I got the red box. So, okay, so out of these. Ooh, Gixian Infiltrator. Interesting. This is even horrible. Stone. Did you ever play the Tower Worker yesterday? This card like actually does a lot of work. I think I had the other two. Got it. Yeah, this card is like pretty good, Tower Worker. Oh, I still have another pack to put. Oh wait, I didn't open my last pack. <laughs> I'm still opening Demolition Field, probably pretty bad. Yeah, last pre-release I didn't get any Mythics, but now I've already like opened a few. Cool. I'm totally playing forces regardless of what's in there. Sigil of Valor. Oh, that card's not that great, is it? If I was playing a Go Wide Soldiers deck or something like that in this set, then that card would not be terrible. But I don't think I have. Basically, I'm put it in your hand and then shuffle. Okay. Sibling rivalry. Gain control of target oh, yeah. artifact or creature until end of turn. Yeah, Untap it. It gains. Oh, that's pretty decent. Oh, no. I don't know. Based you on the red anything, stuff I've opened it. Nope. No. I mean, oh, there's the first. I think that's the. Is that the first like Please. basic no. land I've opened? Yeah. That was me. This was me last night. Yeah. Like, the stone play. brain. Sure. This is the card I was telling you about yesterday, Tim. Oh, that's cool. I don't know if that'll be... It seems like maybe it could be an okay sideboard card if it's constructed. Maybe. I don't know if it's like better than like Pithing Needle or something like that. Another Foundry Inspector. I might be playing those. I think like, I think I might just try to ramp into big creature, or like big artifact creatures. Or a creature with power equal to its toughness enters the battlefield under your control. You may pay one, and if I do, I draw a card. It's not a terrible effect. I don't think there's a lot of creatures in this set, though. That, I don't know, I'm probably wrong about that, but... Not a single creature. No, like, it's just of the same power and toughness. Yes. Yeah. This card's trash. This card's okay. I've liked what I've opened in red. Alright. Red seems decent. Let's pull out my Duder. Autonomous Assembler is what I've gotten <laughs> as my I don't know what that's called, but pre-release card, I guess. Decent. 
I don't know how to open this without bending the card a little bit. Alright. Tim, what's your strategy right now? Uh, artifacts. I think I'm going to keep Black Blade Reforged. That card is just really good in the late game if they can't remove it. Brother's End is ridiculous. Permanents you control have Ward Sacrifice. That's ridiculous. And it gives each thing in my graveyard unearth one. Yeah, I could pretty much, if I have this on the field, play like any artifact I want, regardless of what the unearth cost is. And I could unearth Phyrexian Dragon Engine pretty cheaply. Weak Stone and the Might Stone is good ramp. So let's start putting stuff in the piles here so I can keep track of my creatures too. But even then, Phyrexian Dragon Engine is pretty good. It's 2 2 double strike for 3 mana. It's pretty good value. I think I'll play Foundry Inspector. Mishra's Bobble, I can't tell if that's any good. It seems pretty mid. So. Same with Soul Guide Lantern, it's not very good in this format, I don't think. Uh, I don't know. It's probably okay in a sideboard. Alright, so with Mishra, we get to look at black. Let's start putting creatures into a pile. It's pretty rare. I mean, it's pretty rare you get three. It's different like, if you have three. So, I guess that's what I was getting at. Artifact Golem. This additional cost to cast a spell. This is pretty good. Sacrifice an artifact or creature. We can definitely manage that. Scrap work. Rager. Have you seen this card, Tim? Mm. This card is really good. It's just like Phyrexian Rager, but the uh, artifact version. Oh, yeah. That's funny. Moment of Defiance. <laughs> Seems like it could be a good curve filler. Sacrifice a creature. Add three colorless. Sacrifice a creature. Create a 3 3 colorless zombie. Oh. If I had. This seems like it could be good in like Borzov if you can make a bunch of little creatures. Come through trash. Are you trying to give away your pre release code? I already redeemed my one. Well, then why don't we just. I'll just put it on camera real quick. Yeah, let's just put it, we'll, uh, put it right up here. Let's see who gets it. The, uh,. Camera will focus on it. <laughs> That's probably good enough. Yeah. First person gets it. Okay. Return target artifact or creature card from the graveyard to your hand. Great. That card is really good. I think this is good too. Alright, let's just start. <laughs> I don't know how to do this, Tim. This is tough. Yeah. I got too many colorless cards, so I'm just confused which ones I actually throw in my deck. I like that card, making power stones. Like, I want to be able to ramp. But, like, I opened up some absolutely cracked rares. I don't know, Mishra Tamer of Mach Fala. I don't know if that's how that's pronounced, but it seems like okay. I don't know how great that is. I feel like I just have to play these six cards at the minimum. I think I put Foundry Inspector in here. Yeah. No, I'll play I'll play three of the or two of them. Do I have that equal? That might be okay. 
Just valid two on it, unless two or more colors were spent to cast it. Two one one counters on it, unless two or more colors of mana. Tim, am I misreading this card? To me, it sounds like if you use colorless mana to cast it, it would come in with the counters on it, right? Yeah. Okay, that's what I thought. It's just. Uh, if you use two different colors of mana, colorless is yeah. a color. Yeah. That's what I that's what I was thinking. I just had to make sure. I supply this draw. This one's the ore card. Oh yes, I'm playing that. That card's really good. Yeah. I might have some stuff that's good in blue, so maybe I might want to be just splashing red for the two cards. Or just maybe just for Mishra. But then again, Phyrexian Dragon Engine and Brothers End both have two red ticks, so I don't know if that's like that splashable. Wow. Counter target spell, counter target spell. This one's actually okay because that just straight up counters. Scatter ray is pretty garbage. I'm debating to run 23 colorless cards. Yo, do it. <laughs> oh, but then I wouldn't have any sorceries or instants. Whenever you draw your second card, this gets a 1 1. Decent. Combat courier is actually very decent. Maybe I'm splashing for blue. <laughs> Splitting the power stone. <sighs> I'm gonna start putting the cards that I think that are like somewhat playable. Sorry if I'm, am I intruding too much on your space over No, I have enough. Okay. I need to like, Make a pile, so that's okay. I like these. That might be a filler, but I can never play that for its prototype cost, which is bad. But a a nine nine for nine is pretty efficient, right? Maybe. Maybe in this set with all the power stones might be worth it. Is there anything in green worthwhile? I like Boulder Branch Golem. Argothian Sprite. I like this card, it's pretty decent. Award oh, two okay. for two mana. I don't know if that's that good in the set because there's not like a ton of spot removal. Um, excuse me, this is ridiculous. Tim, look at that guard. Seems all right. That can go in the pile of a maybe. <laughs> I like Tower Worker. I like this. Thopter is a maybe. Supply drop seems decent.
prison sentence. That's really good. <gasps> Wait, maybe I'm stupid. Maybe I'm supposed to be splashing black. For Mishra. Or is Mishra just not worth running? That might just be what it is. Hmm. Over the top seems like a trap card. Like, it's just probably not that good. This seems like it could be okay. Two of them. As long as you control enchanted creature, it gets plus two, plus two, otherwise can't block. Uh, I'm okay with that. Choose target opponent. Destroy target land. That, okay, that's not that good. Could be a curve filler. That's removal. I think my three best colors that I've drawn are definitely... That seems pretty good. to turn it off a while ago. I mean, it's probably the boring part of the video. Oh, right? for sure. Yeah. So thanks for watching. <laughs> Come back to round one later.